When you're talking about the government spending, and yeah, I think uh, you know the the news is that the government is spending more. Yeah. Are they spending on the right things? And from a macroeconomic development standpoint, I mean, where are what is a country like the Philippines? What should they be investing in? I think you know that's you know in a sense when I'm in by efficiency of spending, actually that's the, probably the biggest change since 2010. I mean, if you look at the budget, the composition of the budget has changed a lot. Mm. There's much more money going into health education. You can look at on average, health education budgets have been increasing by 30, 40%. And then infrastructure spending also still very low, but it has been increasing compared to the past quite fast. So those are the, that change in composition has come about because of slightly higher revenues, but also lower interest. So less spending goes on interest, but more money goes on education, health, CCTs, the conditional cash transfers, and infrastructure. And, you know, we do think those are the key areas they should focus on human capital and physical infrastructure. The question is that you want to raise it even more because although there's been an increase recently, it's this level of spending on infrastructure and education and health is still relatively low because tax to GDP in the Philippines is still very low at 13%. So if they can raise more revenues, not to cut the deficit or lower debt, but raise revenues for greater spending on infrastructure, education, health, they'll do much better as well.